Hey guys, and welcome back to Pokeball. Last time we were taking Merity out on a killing spree, and we are continuing our killing spree. And we're going to be fighting trainers for like the next three or four videos. I'm just putting that out there right now. Okay, Nicole. Yeah, you come here often? No? Okay. You just here for like a little bit? Oh, alright. Well, see ya. After I kill your whale, I mean. Alright, so Whalmer, it's kind of almost exactly like Wigglytuff, where it has a ton of HP, but relatively low stats all around. Unless you have one with a good nature, then it might have pretty decent stats. So, wow. Nice. It's pretty good, man. This special attack is just shooting up right now. That's great. Could you take it easy? Well, I kind of already killed you, but if you mean sexually, then sure. Uh, let's see. What's this? One protein! And hey, guess where we are? We're actually on the back of the island in uh, Duford. So we're going to be making a quick pit stop in Duford. Blah. Excuse me. Jeez. <sighs> we're going to be making a quick pit stop in Duford, and we're going to uh, deposit items, and then we're going to uh, we're gonna heal up, and then we're going to continue. But yeah, I noticed in Pokemon Pearl that everything is just super slow. Like, everything just takes forever to do. Talking takes slow, or talking takes slow. Talk, talking is really slow, even when you have like the full text speed. That was like actually one of the first things that I changed. I increased the text speed, and it was still super slow. So, I may or may not do Pokemon Ruby. I mean, not Pokemon Pearl now because God, it's just so slow, and I can't handle it. Especially when you're coming right out of Pokemon Ruby, where everything is nice and crisp and really fast. Because, boom, HP going down super fast. I don't have to wait, like, I literally would have to wait, like, a full three seconds for the HP to decrease down to that level. It's friggin' insane. I don't know what they were thinking, or if it's just an issue with my emulator. I doubt it, though, because this emulates just fine. I don't imagine... I don't really know why that would be the problem. Because they seem to work just fine in emulators, but... Ugh. It's terrible. Okay, so we're here in Duford. I fought these guys, didn't I? Please tell me I fought this guy. Okay, good. Alright. So there's actually no trainers in the water just around Duford, so you don't need to worry about missing anybody just off the island. So, yeah. Uh, I'm going to put that that, and we're going to put away some items so I don't run out of space while I'm in the sunken ship. I can't do everything in the sunken ship just yet, but I want to uh, clear the first areas. Okay, deposit. And the other thing that's it that sucks about uh, Pokemon Pearl is the fact that they that's when they finally started to have, like, uh, attack separation and stuff, so, like, you can have a normal move that can be both special and physical. I mean, um, you know, you can have a normal move, and the normal moves can be either a normal, I mean, a physical or special. Whereas in this game, all normal moves are physical. So, it presents a lot of opportunity for, like, normal special attackers and stuff like that. Because they can actually have a normal move that is a special attack. Okay. Meryl again. See, I think the only problem with Merity is that my special attack is just kind of meh. And also the fact that I don't get stabbed, so all the moves are just at their base power. Which, I mean, they're doing just fine, but, you know, it's it can be a little bit tough to get the job done sometimes. But Merity is actually going to be one of the more important team members. Um, she's going to be one of the most important, especially during the Elite Four, because I don't have any other ice... I don't have any ice types on my list. So... Um, she's gonna be really important. I don't have any ice types. I don't have any fire types. I don't have any psychic types. So she's gonna be my special powerhouse. And I'm gonna have one other special type. I uh, mean, you know, a special attacker. But, uh, we don't have him yet. And I actually don't know if I'm gonna be able to catch him in this, uh, uh, next, in this session. Hopefully I will. I'm hoping that this doesn't take too terribly long. I mean, I did make it through that other route, like, I just blasted through it. I thought I thought this was going to take a long time, but it's not. Alright, wasn't good enough for you. Yeah, you're not good enough for me. Alright, whoop. Yawn. I must have drifted off to sleep while I was drifting in the waves. Uh, that's incredibly dangerous. You could drown. Also, there's probably Sharpedos out here. 
Why are you just swimming around when there's like Sharpedos? Jeez. Although, actually, you know what's ironic? You can only... Oh, haha. <laughs> you constricted me with your tentacles and you, fell, and you fell in love with me. Again, the tentacle monster is not supposed to fall in love with their victim. That's not how it works. I, well, I mean, you know what I mean. I've seen enough hentai to know how this is supposed to go down, and this is not it. Okay. Ugh. Anyway, um, come on. Um, well, there's the uh, there's the quote from the next uh, previously on. Oh my god. <laughs> God, I love making those things. It's been forever since I've done, like, any kind of editing. I'm actually really happy to do a bit of editing now. All right, uh, let's see. How about we use Corin and Merity? How about that? Ooh, what does Little Maid find? <laughs> she found it while she was drowning. Oh, a nugget! Wow, she found an undersea nugget. <laughs> All right. So, uh, let's go ahead and fight them. But yeah, could you just imagine, like, I'm standing, I'm surfing on top of my, uh... Oh, you know, on top of my little raccoon, and it just happens to find a nugget, just grabs it in its mouth. That's funny. Uh, Thunderbolt, let's get rid of the tentacle. Actually, no, let's do this. Thunderbolt on the Goldeen, and I'll crush claw the tentacle. Boom! Get out of here. Ha ha! Yeah, because tentacle has a lot of special defense, it does not have a lot of physical defense. See, I know how to assault different Pokemon, I know how to attack them. Alright. It's because I'm a giant nerd, that's why. All right. And you are dead, because you have no physical... You don't have much defenses at all. You're basically just a, an attacker. And that's the other thing. I really want to use a Sea King. Because I've had I've had a lot of these Pokemon games where it's like, Oh, Goldeen's cool, but wait a minute. It's a physical attacker, and in these games, Waterfall is all special. It's not good. But in Pokemon Pearl, I could use a Sea King, because Waterfall is physical. I know I'm talking about Pokemon Pearl a lot, but this is a Pokemon Let's Play, and I was just playing Pokemon Pearl. And technically, I do still have that file. I'm still playing through it. I'm doing it the same way I'm doing this one. I'm not using the normal starter, and I've picked another Pokemon. Which I'm not going to go into any uh, team members I have in that, because, you know. <sighs> but yeah, it's like, oh my god. It's just a giant pain in the ass. But, oh well. I might do it, I might not, but I'll tell you right now, if I do it, there's going to be a lot of moments where I get really impatient. I will tell you that right now. Because I assume that anybody watching this would be excited to watch one of Pokemon Pearl, especially considering that, you know, it was basically my first major Pokemon game. Because you could online battle in it, and that's how I raised a lot of my, my famous teams! Not really famous, but you know what I mean. Um... So, I imagine that anybody watching this would be pretty pretty stoked to watch that, but if you are interested in watching that, and I probably will do it, regardless of how annoying it is, but if you watch that, just know that I will be incredibly annoyed during most of the game, because it's just so damn slow. Oh wait, I didn't see what this person said. She said something about boyfriend in bikini. That's all I saw. Woo, horsey. That's actually a teammate I considered, but it turns out that it... Um, see, the problem is, it's not the evolution problem, because obviously, you know, I can just tell it to evolve to whatever I want to, but, um, the problem is, it doesn't learn any dragon moves, it learns Twister, and that's it, and Twister, I think, has a power of 20? So, yeah, I would have gotten it, but it doesn't learn any good moves. There's no TM for Dragon Breath, and it never... I think it learns Dragon Breath as an egg move, unfortunately. So, I would have, but I didn't. There we go. My dream is to swim the world's seven seas. Well, then why are you just constantly swimming in this one? And by the way, I don't think there's actually seven seas in this world. Actually, what ocean would this be? If, it, if this is set in Japan, what ocean is this? I don't actually know. I guess it's just the Pacific? Do they have a different ocean, or do they... Yeah, is that a different ocean, or do they have... Or are they just in the Pacific? I think they're just in the Pacific. I don't know that much about oceans. Let's see. There's the Atlantic Ocean. Uh, there's the Atlantic Ocean, the Pacific Ocean, the Indian Ocean. Um, does the Medi Mediterranean Sea count as an ocean? And then I think there's the Arctic and Antarctic. 
Uh, I don't know any other oceans. I think I know five. Five of the seven. That's not that bad. I think. I don't know. Again, if the Mediterranean Sea doesn't count, then I don't know. I don't know that many of them. I only know four, technically, then. All right. So this is the sunken ship, even though it's not sunken. Oh, it's abandoned. Okay. Even though it's not abandoned. See? There's people. <laughs> okay. Uh, now, this place doesn't have just water trainers. So while I'm here, I'm going to train up Skittles and Handjob and Sparks. Sparks, first of all. I'm going to try to get him way higher. Uh, it's empty. God, I love the music here. It's so great. God, I love the music here. It's so great. And, like, I don't know. I just really like it. Okay. One harbor mail. Bastard. Okay. I'm gonna immediately throw you away, because I don't want you. Toss. Yes. You're not even worth the 50 bucks I'd get for you. Which is kind of funny. Have you ever bought a letter, and they're like, oh, it'll be 50 bucks. Is it fun here? I get excited just being here. Oh, jeez, calm down. Keep it in your pants, man. All right. <laughs> Anyway, that is the uh, supply closet, or the storage closet. Um, that contains Ice Beam. That is very, very good. It's the move I taught Merity, obviously. So wait a minute! Hmm! So she knows Ice Beam. She knows... Let me see here. She knows Ice Beam, Flamethrower, Thunderbolt, and Psychic. The Psychic doesn't really count, but technically... I could start yelling out Celsius, Volt, and Ifrit if I wanted to, but I'm not going to. Because I talk about that series enough as it is. Ooh, I'm a choke. Well, uh, let's give it a shot. Why not? Because, oh, well, I sure hope I'm faster. Because if I'm not faster, this could be bad. All right. Psychic. Yay. Come on, kill it. I got my fingers crossed. Yeah. Haha! -ha. Alright, let's go ahead and level up from that. Bam! Doop! And 144 HP, I love it. God, that's fantastic. Whoops, I'm sunk. Yes, you are. Just like the ship. Oh, wait, no, it's abandoned. Doo -doo -doo -doo. What do you got? Herb. I'm getting queasy just being aboard this ship. It's not even moving, but herb. Ew. It's not empty, it's filled with vomit. So, if you go in here, uh, this is how you access the different areas. You see how there's that kind of. You know that little cross there of dark water? Well, later on we're going to get an HM that allows us to go underwater. And that's how we access the entirety of the ship. On escape rope. So, uh, we're going to be coming back here once we get that. But for now, I just want to clear out the trainers that are here. Yay, it's a ship. Yay, it's a ship. Yay, it's a ship. Okay. Ooh, a dive ball. I believe dive balls are good against Pokemon that are just in the water, I think. But they're also good as you're diving. Uh, that's a perfect place to go this morning. It's exciting here. I bet there's amazing treasures on board. Well, not really. It's just a cruise liner. Unless you're trying to loot the dead bodies. Because I can only assume that they crashed and people have died. Okay. What's so funny about having my inner tube aboard a ship? Well, nothing really. Because if it's a crashed ship, there might actually be areas that are underwater. So it would be good to have that. Well, I mean, not really, because then it would make it hard to swim if you actually need to swim through, like, an, uh, oh, crap. Uh, probably won't do too much, yeah. Um, it might, that would be very detrimental if you needed to swim through, like, a sunken passageway, but if you're trying to stay above the water, then, yeah. Whoa, you overwhelmed me. Yeah, but you having an inner tube is kind of dumb. It's not easy throwing Pokeballs while hanging onto an inner tube. Well, then let go of it! Okay, I actually never thought of that. That's kind of a funny line. I never I never would have thought of that until he brought it up. All right. Ooh, we got a couple here. Uh, okay. Yeah, let's just go with Sparks and Skittles. Actually, wait a minute. Let's see. How close are they to up uh, there? He's... Okay. I'll get, uh... uh... Tough. They're kind of the same level. But Lois? Oh god damn it. What is the other guy's name? Please be Clark. Please, 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 come on. Damn it! Oh come on! Oh, they have Volbeat and Illumise. Cool. Boop, boop. Aha. Uh 
let's go ahead and do Confuse Ray on the Volbeat, and actually, wait a minute, let's do this. Signal Beam on the Ilamise, and I will just do Sacred Power on Volbeat. Boop! Now, thankfully, Bug does not resist Bug. Boom! Wow, it lived! Oh no, I hate you! Yeah, that's one of the things that Ilamise learns. <sighs> you don't... <laughs> You're not a special attacker. You're so dumb. Oh, it's sharply rose. I was not aware that it was a sharply rising. Like a double rise of a special attack. But hey, it didn't raise your physical attack. So, good job. No wish for you. Ha. Alright. So, what wish does is you make a wish, and then the next turn after that, you will heal. So, basically, if... If, um... Oh, wow, you're strong, yes. So, if basically, if the Iwamise survived that turn, it would have healed half of its health. So, there you go. It's a very good healing move if you use uh, Eeveelutions, because they all learn it, as far as I know. And it's a great way to uh, heal, like, a uh, an Umbreon. So, yeah. Or you could just use Moonlight. I'm investigating the ship on behalf of Captain Stern. He also asked me to find a scanner. Okay. So, that's what you want. Uh, if you go to the the underwater areas of the ship, you can find the scanner, and then you give it to him and he gives you something. Or you go back to Captain Stern, and then you give it to him and he gives you something. Oh, wait, no, I remember exactly what he gives you. He gives the, um... By the way, TM-13, Ice Beam. Um, he gives you the Deep Sea... He gives you a choice between the Deep Sea Scale and the Deep Sea Tooth, and those will evolve the Pokémon Clam Pearl into a pair of actually very cool Pokémon, which you'll never really see, because... Uh, basically, you have to trade it while it's holding that item. I also considered getting one of them, because they're very cool. Um, let's just go with Sparks for now. Okay, move one space, and then wait, because I'm patient. But I'm not patient enough for Pokemon Pearl, because it's freaking stupid. Ugh. Okay. I guess this route did take a little bit of time. Missy. Ugh. Did you name your child Missy? Ugh. I can I can see it as a nickname, but not an actual name. Because you usually give your real name, and then it's like, oh, everybody just calls me Missy. You know, not just, oh, my name is Missy. <sighs> oh, well. Oh, come on! God, I keep... It's always these fat Pokemon. There's always fat Pokemon that decide to live. Why can't there be a fat Pokemon that's, like, really easy to kill? I guess Chansey is one of them, but still. Oh, now! Don't be doing that. Don't get, like, one pixel away from leveling up. Boop. So if you're having trouble with the uh, the next gym in the game, this is a great place to train, because there's just tons and tons of trainers and stuff. You know, the combination of this route beneath Slateport and the area near Old Ale Town. Uh, it's a very... Actually, no, wait. Uh, Petalburg, my bad. It's a great place to train. So, yeah. Be sure you come here if you're having trouble with the next gym. Which, I will not have trouble with the next gym because I have Merity. So, ha 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 ha. Alright. Because Merity has the move... Oh! I... <laughs> it's... I love Secret Power! There's a lot of times when I'm just like, Whoa, wait, what? Oh, yeah, it changes. It's kind of a surprising and unpredictable move. I like it. I like it because of that. It keeps things interesting. But, okay. Now that we have continued along the route and we are still murdering... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Let me grab that. So I'm sure people will be like, No, we had an item! Uh, Super Potion. I'll go ahead and use that on... What's his name? Sparks. Okay, so, next time on Pokeball, we're going to continue on the route, finish it off, and then we're going to head to the next area of the game. So yeah, it's going to be great. See you then.